Hi YouTube, uh, this is Cameron Simpson, CS Trades 101. Thank you for joining me today again. Um, this podcast we're going to be covering um, a green market. Every one of my stocks in my portfolio are green. This is rare. This happens only maybe a handful of times a year when they're all in sync. Um, so no new news. It just uh, the way the market's playing um, along with the stimulus checks and up here in Canada with our CERB and all that stuff. It's just a dump of money into the system. So I'm not a broker or a financial advisor. So take it from there. Um, do your own diligence. And um, we got some, uh, I got a, something that's, that happened to me a couple minutes before I jumped on the air here and it just kind of put a smile on my face. Um, uh, reconnected with an old friend. It's been years. I can't even know how many years. And uh, you know who I'm talking about. Um, his name's Ryan. Um, yeah, yeah, really, really, really good guy. Um, we had some good memories uh, as kids. Yeah, we were kids. We were just teenagers and stuff. Uh, we came both came from a small town. So, yeah, it was it was it was pretty good. Um, it was pretty good. It put a smile on my face, and um, my cheeks are still hiding from smiling. I haven't smiled in a long time like that. It just put a good, warm, brotherly love feeling in my heart. So enough for the sappy stuff. Um, I'm glad you're doing good, Ryan, and keep it real, man. And I can't wait till the uh, COVID's over and we can connect. So. Anyways, uh, let's jump on into the market here. This is a this is a very very bullish market right now. Um, yeah, I'm very very bullish today. Like horns right out, man, just raring to go. So, <clears throat> like I shot the podcast last night, uh, uh, Wolfgang Wolfpack. So, um, if you all don't know, um, our, my group's called the Wolfpack because we target things and we go for it, and uh, our very good success rate here. Um, Last podcast, I discussed on how to flip $200 into multiple, multiple, multiple thousands of dollars and building a huge portfolio in six months, okay, um, which I went over um, the other day. But I want to show you how that portfolio can actually play out for you. And this is what I was talking about, about how flipping, okay, this is uh, Paper Hands. Um, so being Paper Hands, if you guys are new um, to our channel, which we, we, we want new people and beginners to start because it's a learning curve. And it's free education. You can't get really good free education out there. But everybody, um, take it with a grain of salt. I want you to double check everything I talk about. That's your job to do. Don't take it. I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just uh, speaking out my uh, mouth and um, doing what I find is right. But um, with all the comments and the amount of money and bank statements people have shown me, how much cheddar they've made over the last couple of weeks is crazy, man. So it's not like I invented anything new. It's just calling, paying attention to the market. So you got to go on four times a day. So I've already been on lots. I, I, I just got tied up with that good friend talk there, uh, which is not a problem. I'll put my life on hold for friends any day, same as I do it for um, for all of you guys, uh, the wolf pack on uh, my YouTube channel, right? So let's stop talking. When you get me talking about friends, I can just talk forever. Same as I talk about you guys. So um, yeah, let's jump right on into the market, guys. Okay, yeah, oh, by the way, if you wanna see more videos um, and uh, get the stuff out there, hit the like button, it goes a long ways, and subscribing would be awesome because then it definitely gets out there on multiple platforms. Okay, thank you, Wolfpack, for that. And um, let's jump on here. We are, we are looking at ticker symbol AMC right now. Look at this thing rip, okay? When I say rip, anything over 10 is classed as a baby rip. Okay, because um, trying to get ten percent anywhere, like any bank or any anything like that, you're not gonna get that. You two, three, five percent, and you're happening, man. That's pretty hurting. But five percent, you're happening. That's why I dominate the market like this, right? So look at this thing. Just go. I called this yesterday on AMC, and and like that's um, why I got multiple track record returns on my channel is because obviously you guys are um, making some cheddar. So that's good, 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 good. I, I like to see it, but be careful, it is gambling, okay? So let's jump on to AMC. Look at this baby this morning, oh, look at this. Sorry for hitting the way, oh, look at this. Four million share buy-in, oh, I love it, I love it, I love it. So look at four million, 3,579 shares. Okay, so. This is awesome. This just bumped us. This is like somebody giving you a push down a set of stairs. 
So um, yeah, like this is deadly. This was definitely a good buy-in and it just drove it. It gave it momentum. We busted through two lines of resistance on that one push. Okay. So what we are doing, we're testing out levels, uh, $11.55 for a line of resistance right now. We got to bust through that line of resistance. We will not do it today, guys. I I I'm sorry. Um, maybe, what are we, 11.31, power hour. Mm, I don't know. I'm very bullish on this, but um, I, I just can't see it busting um, up to uh, up to uh, into the twelve dollar range right now. Um, we got a couple more lines of resistance to bust through. Um, let's check out the volume. Yeah, see, and these charts aren't accurate, as we all know, right? There's a lot of a lot of uh, bullshit going on around with this stock. All the numbers, synthetic shares, fraudulent shares, naked shares, shorting. It is just a domino effect of a shit show. So when they do the when they do the um, the share recount, if they do it um, on ACM Entertainment Holdings, um, I think we're going to see a big light at the end of the tunnel. Um, all these people that own shares um, don't really own shares; they're synthetic, most of them. Yeah, and we got a problem with this one uh, stock, which it doesn't. It, it, it's it's going to screw the hedge funds. It, it doesn't do anything to us. We we got our we got our paperwork saying we paid for it, and I own a substantial amount of stake in this too. <laughs> I, excuse me, um, I got, um, what did I spend about 15? Well, it's not huge, but it's, it's, it's a little bit of cheddar. Um, I got about 15,000 US into this. So I got probably close to, I bought a little bit high. I got two, two different lots. Um, I bought at 820. Um, I think I bought 180 shares at that $8 and 20 cents. And then I bought higher, I think it was at $14. So I'm already getting some cheddar back on uh, my one lot. The second lot, um, I say by Wednesday, Thursday, I'm going to be big smile on my face, but I, I'm always happy anyways, because I know how the market goes up and down. So yeah, let's check in on this. Let's spread this baby open. Okay. Let's see these trying to, and, 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 and I see, I see a little bit of a, looks like a cup forming here, right? And after a cup and a handle, there's going to be another push. They definitely, um, we need some more volume here. Definitely to get that up there. What are we hitting right here? What, what are these, uh, what line are we testing here? We've tested it uh, twice today, $11.35. So we got to bust that line of resistance. We tried it twice and we couldn't make it. So um, it'll try multiple times today for sure. Um, a lot of people are, uh, what time is it here? 11 o'clock in, uh, in BC, Canada. So we're Pacific Standard Time. So yeah, most of the market's up. All the lazy ones are up, including me. So, um, yeah, I'm always up uh, early. I'm a little bit late on my podcast this morning just because of a talk with a friend, but that's all good. I put, like I said, anything on hold for you guys. So um, we're going to get a little bit of sideways action. I would like to see that sideways action carried to about here. A little bit of consolidation, build some more um, volume up, and then give her a push. Then give her a push, and she's going to she's gonna bump. Okay, so we got a lot to cover today there, ladies and gentlemen. So... GME GameStop. We'll put this back on the one minute chart. Let's just see, um, when there's not that much volume, I bump the um, platform to a five minute. It's just easier to show you guys and easier to follow the statistics and the guidelines um, of the platform. So we got a little bit of a sell off. We are in um, $162 and uh, some change. Um, we're at 7.3% in the green today on GME. And um, yeah, I just wanted to tell you that the line of resistance go over that 164.45 is what we got to bust. They've already, it's, uh, uh, the Alpha Rhythms uh, have already tested it out uh, twice or three times, sorry, correction. Three times, we've got one candle wick right there, another candle wick and another candle wick. Two reds and one. So we've only given it one shot really to, um, to try to test it. Um, they're trying to drive it down, um, the, the, the sellers. So um, we'd like to see a W form here. I'd like to see a little bit more consolidation. I would like to see a W because um, after a W, there's usually a run, right? 90% chance of a run a bit. So um, I'd like to see a little bit more sideways action here um, and then a push. There we go. There's our little bit of a push as we speak. Okay. So let's jump on to the energy sector in Canada. It's ticker symbol SU, Suncor, we are up in the positive 0.51%. It's not much, but we take what we can get nowadays, man, with this market all over the place. So 
This is our energy sector up here. Um, this is where we get our, all our gas and uh, refine. Uh, we send it down the states and get it all refined for you guys down in the U.S. to use our gas and then send it back up here. And we pay double the money. It's it's an awesome awesome gig. So um, I'm not going to go much over this. I just wanted to show you that um, there's some huge buy-ins. Um, what do we got on this? Oh wow, twenty-four thousand shares, and that's pretty good for Suncor. Um, that that definitely drove it up, and they hit this wick, and then they they tried testing it again down it tried driving us back down but it couldn't it had to hold that okay until it tested over here and it locked in so <clears throat> i'm not going to go through my whole um portfolio i'm i'll be here for hours what i'm going to do is um i'm going to shoot a two-part video today um this will be the first part so um i'm going to go we got blackberry at, at, it's at eleven dollars and 20 or 32 cents and we are in the positive 2.44 percent in the green right now and that's my little baby too I, I own some blackberry too loop energy out of chilliwack british columbia canada um hydro hydro uh energy right so hydrogen so um it is at ten dollars 13 cents it is at positive one four zero in the green i will not buy into this until it hits seven dollars it, it, it just it's only been a couple of three months old this uh this stock it started at 17 um it uh they really were adamant they're gonna get that i disagreed and i have it all covered all over my channels that it's too high right now the market will find the price for that okay we don't judge that. The market judges that. I laugh at companies that come in. So I want this. I want this. <laughs> You'll get what the market puts you at. Air Canada. I own in this. And this is a, they just went for, through a um, um, bankruptcy uh, bailout uh, talk with the government, which drove it down the last couple of days. It was up at 26 or $27. It drove it down within about a week to about 25, 24. I was ahead about a buck on it then. Um, it, I'm now what a couple bucks ahead now it, this will fluctuate it will not go bankrupt it is our main aviation sector that's this is the big boy this is the big cat okay the government will let it go under and I've covered that months ago and uh, and um, see I don't lie to you guys right but always check the information okay oh we got one in the um, 4% minus 4.76% fuse cobalt okay it is uh, only a penny, well, most of these are penny stocks, but um, this is a penny stock. It's only selling for 10 cents a share. It's a buy-in, man. Today is a buy-in on that. I would I would definitely load up on that little bad boy. Um, you could pump a huge of 30,000 shares like nothing at 10 cents, right? And then, uh, like I told you before, when you double it or get 75%, you sell, you sell uh, three quarters and keep a quarter in and keep on doing that. Right, and that's how you build a portfolio up like this. Like, look at that, man. Like, that's only in six months, right? So, visions, lithium. Okay, this stuff is from Quebec, Canada, and it's ninety nine point nine percent pure lithium. Okay, for Evo cars, you you EV cars, you can't um, you get better lithium for the batteries than this. This is the gold. Okay, it's at it's it's uh, it's only a penny stock too. It's uh it's seventeen cents right now. It's a it's a buy in, man. I, I own large in this one um, because it's so cheap. I think I put five grand on. I, I can't recall how many shares I bought. A little bit higher. I'm in the red on this, but it's all good. These are these are these aren't paper hand shares, man. You can paper hand them until you flip it. I'll paper hand it a bit unless it's AMC. If it's something like that and I'm doing it for a cause, it's different. I won't sell out until I get to the per the place I want to be, right? And everybody has their own story, okay? Like if, like for instance, um, I got a cat here with uh, one of our cats has um, it's a little baby kitten and it uh, has a, a hole in its heart and it has to go in for a plug and it's uh, ten thousand dollars Canadian. And um, do I bat an eye? No, no, I don't because. Um, it's a living thing. Um, this stuff can come and go, right? Right. Um, money's money. Money can always be made, and it's easy to make right now, especially on stocks. Like um, I could start back with two hundred dollars again and, and flip it, and probably do better now because I'm more educated in the in six months. I can turn that into probably close to one hundred G in six months. Okay. So, on Turner Zaraz. Okay. This is in the third try us. Uh, 
tries for COVID pill. This is a one shot deal. You get the pill, you take it, no temperature restrictions on the pill, no second dose. Boom. This is a frigging gold mine. Okay. I've this thing fluctuates. It'll go down to a dollar, two dollars and fifty cents, back down. Bam. This is the one I've made a lot of money on. Look at this. It's doing a rip right now, man. And this is into a rip now. It's at 16%. Any, like I said, a mini rip is at anything over 10. So this is, I would be watching this today. I would just have hawk eyes on this one. Um, this in AMC is just going up right on. AMC is at 11.25. Yeah, I love days like this. So anyways, um, this is a buy-in, right? I'd be, I wouldn't buy it today. I would wait until you get obviously a dip and then I'd buy in on it. And then, um, yeah, flip it. <laughs> this is a good flipper. Okay, um, we're not gonna cover the TD Bank. Um, we're not going to cover these banks. Sundial um, is up at uh, it's at 0.8715, so it's 87 cents um, a sh uh, stock right now or shares. Um, 4.40 in the green, positive today. There's a lot of happy pot smokers out there. So, anyways, um, I don't own stake in this, but I support the movement. Okay, Growth Canopy went partners with Supreme couple weeks ago up in Canada here another weed stock very very good idea these two going partners I do not own start I will not buy into marijuana stocks right now I missed my go on this one um, in um, the reddit uh, the reddit push there but I, I'll, I won't I, I support it and cover it but I won't buy in right now um, I, I got I got other plans I got a system I do and this is I stick to my system very grounded Okay, so we're not going to cover uh, Doji and Bitcoin today. We're not going to cover that because um, we're not covering crypto today. So I just wanted to wrap up on EMC. So yeah, oh, she's going up. Look at that. Look at that. I called that. Hey, eh? look at that. I called the solidation and it was going to go up. See? Ah. Oh, I love that. I love it. It just drives me further, further and further further into a diamond hands man I, I'm just my hands are like all cut up from the diamonds I'm holding so anyways don't listen to these charts they're bold okay there's people that these hedge funds own millions and millions and billions and billions of dollars and um, they can mock this and pay it's a computer simulation um, I'm I could probably hack the thing and fuck it up right like it's it's not that bad it's not a it's an open system it's not uh, a closed circuit it's an open circuit. Um, I'm guaranteed that there's people hacking it. So anyway, not that I would do something like that. I, I'm into legit stuff like this. So anyways, um, I'm going to wrap this today. And I just wanted to tell everybody out there that uh, thumbs up, man. I love the sea of green, eh? It looks awesome. And everybody that's copied um, but did their own due diligence because I'm like, I'm not an an, I'm an analyst, but I'm not licensed broker or an advisor. Okay, so you do your own diligence. But uh, if you can use, if you want to use it as a template, that's fine, and just do your own research and stuff. But people have followed my progress and um, have pretty much mirrored me. You're gonna have a pretty good smile, and you check your portfolio out at the end of the day. Check out the green and the positive what you had just in one day. Thank you. So, anyways, Wolfpack, keep it real. And um, I'm going to sign out of here, man. I'm going to peace out on you guys. Um, if you wanted to get more content, thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. It goes a long ways. And um, yeah, I just want to put it out there, man. If you have friends that you haven't talked to in a while, reconnect, man. It's COVID. Not perfect time to get on the computer or your, or your phone and just light it up, man. Talk to some people that you haven't uh, talked to in a while, man. There's a lot of people out there that uh, have lost con connections with uh, old, old friends. And uh Perfect opportunity to get back in touch with people. Okay, this is Cameron Simpson from CS Trades. I'm out of here.